There has been a lot going on with the Colleen Ballinger drama and it is a lot to keep up with. Trisha Paytas has now responded to the receipts and screenshots of Colleen Ballinger sending Trisha's nude photos and videos to a group chat and making fun of Trisha's body. To make matters worse, this group chat contained minors. And to be honest, I mean, correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure that that is a felony to be taking people's OF content and distributing it. And that's gotta be some other type of felony as well to be distributing these, you know, images and videos to minors. Trisha posted a video last night on her YouTube channel and titled it Colleen. I will never speak on Colleen again. She, she just does not exist to me anymore. It honestly made me feel some type of way watching Trisha's video because she seemed genuinely upset and disappointed. And we all know that Trisha Paytas does not have, you know, the cleanest track record, but I feel like she's come a long way since her problematic past. I try to take myself out of these equations when I'm feeling triggered. In her video, Trisha addressed the evidence of Colleen distributing Trisha's OF content. The text messages were shown and it's very clearly from Colleen to a fan. Has over half a million views on Twitter that I'm um, not embarrassed by, I'm embarrassed for her. Trisha Paytas and Colleen Ballinger recently started a podcast together and were supposed to have been friends. So I can only imagine how crushed Trisha must feel right now after seeing all of this evidence of Colleen exploiting her nude photos and videos and making fun of her body. Colleen was reportedly sending these images to a group chat within her own fandom where she would laugh and joke about Trisha's body with the other people in the group chat, picking apart Trisha's flaws and making fun of the fact that she does SW. Trisha stated in her video that she isn't here to cancel Colleen, but honestly, I feel like that's already been done. Trisha went on to say that a couple weeks ago when she first heard of these allegations against Colleen, she confronted Colleen and asked her if the allegations were true. Colleen then replied saying, no, none of it is true. It was all taken out of context and that she would never distribute Trisha's OF content like that, which I was surprised because I didn't even realize that Trisha Trisha was still doing SW. She said in her video that she still does it full time and that it's just not as promoted as it once was on her other channels, which honestly shocked me because I thought that she had left that in the past. So that was newest to me. Did you guys still know that? Colleen's ex-husband Joshua Evans came forward with his own truth on a Twitter post posted on June 28th. He said, anyone feeling hurt and gaslit right now, my message to you is this. Your experiences were real. The proof is there. Your trauma should be taken seriously. The proof is there. Your anger is justified. The proof is there. You deserve better. Take your power back. Sending you love. This behavior was my reality anytime I spoke up and disagreed with her actions and rhetoric during 2009 to 2016. I was gaslit too. I was made to feel like I was always the problem. Any pain I felt was an inconvenience and was belittled. Every ounce of what you're feeling, I understand. I have no desire to use this as a catalyst for a YouTube comeback. It's not a safe place for me. I'm past that. My voice is only here to help validate those that are hurting, nothing more. I have no need to make any money off this. That is gross and not in my heart whatsoever. Sorry if it looks different, my camera died, so I went to TJ Maxx and I bought this blinged out velour juicy suit. <clears throat> But that pretty much concludes today's video, you guys. That's what Trisha Paytas and Colleen's ex-husband had to say about the matter. What are your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comments down below. And if there's any other topics that you want me to cover, you can let me know in the comments or you can send me a DM on Instagram. Right now I have several different topics that I'm researching and I can't wait to post those videos. So make sure you subscribe so you don't miss those. And yeah, that's it for this video. Okay, bye.